Hey! So, we are almost at the end of a decade. Mm, time is flying, right? 2010 to now we are approaching 2020. And optimistic. Optimistic is that's what my approach to the next the theme was because you know you keep going as time and time and time and time unfolds um, the lessons that you were supposed to learn in this life whether it's in relationships or in feelings or in things that that happen to you they keep happening until you learn from them and to be perfectly honest and all the way real worth worth was huge for me and I can't say that I didn't feel worthy as a whole I always tend to be in the moment when I'm enjoying my life because I'm always enjoying my life every single day is a blessing that I open my eyes and especially the fact that I'm able to talk to you and I'm able to be a mom to my son overall I was playing small I was keeping my mouth shut and a smile on my face and I wasn't happy and it wasn't that I didn't think that I deserved happiness because I definitely did but so focused on not rocking the boat or making the people around me unhappy I diminished my greatness and I'm pretty darn great and it chips at you. It chips at your worth. It chips at where it is. And then all of a sudden, as I started to be able to monetize my skills and set my prices, Birdie didn't know how much he was actually worth. I was shortcutting myself because I didn't know. Because I give freely. I've always been somebody you could tap on the shoulder and say, hey, what is this? What is that? And of course, if I got it, I give it to you. But the saying is, you can't pour from an empty cup. Okay, everybody hears that one. But my cup runneth over. It's in the Bible. And you can't bless people with stuff that's in your cup. That's the piece that I needed to learn. You can't bless people from inside your cup. However big or small the cup is, I have to stay full in order to give to you. And I'm full. I'm good. So I feel free to give to you. And when I can't, I don't. So I'm listening to myself now. What lessons have you learned now? I am very curious to know. So, if you want to, leave a comment. Let me know what have you gotten the gist of in your growth and development. Even something that you feel like you need to, to work on, but don't want to take into this next decade. Later, y'all.